What if you could edit your architectural walkthroughs and change the lighting, materials, even camera angles just by typing in a few words? That's exactly what Runway Aleph lets you do. Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today, we'll take a look at a rather unique and impressive tool from Runway called Runway Aleph. This is an AI tool specifically for editing and generating videos using simple text prompts. You can change the lighting, materials, furniture or even the camera angles without even having to touch a 3D software. For architects and interior designers, this means you can quickly visualize your design ideas or create cinematic walkthroughs directly from your site images and renders. We'll jump in and take a look at this to understand this further and also take a look at some of the use cases for designers. I'm Salman, an architect and an illustrator. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe so we can create more amazing content like this. So let's get started. You can access Runway Aleph from the link in the description through the Runway website. Note that this comes as a subscription tool, so you'll have to purchase one of the plans to get started with this tool. Once you do, select the app, choose the video model, make sure you selected Gen 4, which is the Aleph model, image to video. We've seen a lot of AI tools which turn images into video, but this one specifically stands out because of its cinematic quality. We can upload an image in this tab for this example, I'll be uploading this elevation view of a villa elevation and try changing this into a video walkthrough. Once you add the image, you'll be able to change the resolution of it with these options. We have multiple resolution options to choose from and you can crop the image accordingly. Let's go ahead with the 16 to 9 ratio. As for the prompt, let's add that the camera pans in slowly towards the villa. Add parallax and depth Do not change or alter anything in the scene. We can change the duration to 5 or 10 seconds as we prefer. Let's choose 5 in this case. The platform will use credits depending on the duration. Inside the settings, we have the option to choose a seed which will give us similar results and the resolution is 720 which can be upscaled to 4K as well. Click generate to create the output. The platform manages to give us a cinematic camera pan effect and all the elements appear three-dimensional with realistic shadows and lighting. We can play around with camera movements as well as we prefer. Relight videos. We've seen a lot of AI tools that can change the environment of any architectural space within an image, but this one does that within videos as well, which is a lot more impressive. For this example, let's use the video that we previously generated and let's try changing the environment. We'll have to upload it in the same tab as earlier. Once we've uploaded, we have the option to trim the video. Note that we'll only be able to use 5 second duration of the video. As for the prompt, I've described an evening golden hour lighting where the interiors of the villa look illuminated, add small garden lamps in the front yard and the camera pans in slowly. We can actually add a reference image to help the platform understand the requirements better. I've added this image of a villa in golden hour lighting which is similar to the output that I'm expecting. Click generate and this will start creating the output. The time taken varies with the complexity of the output and the credits are charged accordingly. Here's the result. Obviously, there's one large floating bed in the center of the video, but apart from that, the lighting and all the other details look fascinating. The platform has not changed any details in the scene, which is a great advantage while working on real projects. The camera movement of the input video has also been retained. Here is a comparison of the before and after. Generate new camera angles. Let's use the same video of the villa that we previously generated for this example as well. I'm currently on the same project. Let's type in the prompt to create another view of this villa as an aerial drone style view, keeping all the details of the video exactly as it is. This example will not need a reference image since this is straightforward. Click generate to create the output. We have the output and on the first glance, this definitely looks stunning. We can see a slight change in the color tone of the building where the output looks a little cooler. But apart from that, the architectural details of the building, the landscapes in the front yard and even all the small plants and bushes look exactly the same as the reference image. This can be a game changer in architectural presentations and storytelling. Architects and design firms can now use this tool to present their ideas better and also for marketing and social media. Here's a comparison of the before and after. We can also extend the duration of a video 
and upscale them to 4K as well. Before we move on to the next one, I want to share with you about my masterclass on realistic floor plan rendering with Nano Banana and Photoshop. In this masterclass, we will take a look at how to turn our boring CAD drawings into realistic renders with Nano Banana. A lot of architects have learned to create realistic renders and stylized floor plans with this masterclass and you'll also be getting a PDF with a list of prompts and references to try. What used to take a day or two will now be possible within a few minutes. Check out the Gumroad link in the description to access this masterclass. Virtual Staging Interiors You might have taken a video of a bare shell interior on your side visit. Using this tool, you'll be able to quickly visualize that with furnitures and decor. Here is a video of an empty bare shell interior which is in the style of a New York loft design. Let's see how we can add furnitures into this video directly. Firstly, let's upload the video into the Assets tab. Now, just for the sake of demonstration, I tried using ChatGPT to create a prompt to generate sofas and interior styling for a New York loft gallery style interior. I then copy pasted the prompt inside the box and click generate. The output looks nice and aesthetic, but if you look closely, we notice that most of the elements do not make sense. And the prom has even added a wall on the left side. And this is not something that we want. So I then use this mode board, which is of the same style that we expect. I've added that as the reference. I've also described all the elements that I want to be placed in the video for better accuracy. Click generate and this time the results were far better. I do see a problem with the sofa in front, but for a quick trial like this, the results are really good. Changing elements in video. Changing certain elements in a video takes a lot of time, effort, and VFX softwares, but using this tool, this will now be possible within a minute. Here's the video that we'll be using for this. An interior modern villa that looks minimal yet luxurious. Let's upload it into the tab. Let's trim off the portions if necessary. As for the reference, I'll be using this mood board that I found on Pinterest. Let's upload it and describe the prompt for the details we want to change. I want to change the furniture to the exact style in the mood board. The flooring to be of herringbone oak wood flooring, color palette and decor to match exactly with the reference image. Click generate and we can see how all the elements in the mood board have been seamlessly integrated into the video. Making this change traditionally would take hours of work and editing. But with Runway Alp, we are able to make this change with just a few clicks. Change designs on drone shots. I'd like to point out that this is not perfect, but definitely something you could try out. Here's an image of a villa located in a nice and scenic farm. Let's upload that and try creating a drone style video of the same. Let's go with the square ratio and describe the camera movement as the prompt. Click generate and this will give us a drone style footage of the villa. Let's download this video and add it as the base to rework on. Now for the reference image, I have this modern style villa which has curved and fluid geometry. Let's add that and prompt it to change the villa from the video and replace it with the one on the reference image. The result, as I mentioned earlier, was not the exact same villa, but it does have a potential in changing a complex element in a video. Basically, the tool does not understand architectural design like Nano Banana or other tools, but definitely not a bad attempt. So that was it from the use cases of Runway Alep. Let me know which of these you found the most interesting and are excited to try. Make sure to check the Gumroad link in the description to access the Nano Banana Flow Plan Rendering Masterclass. We hope you found this video to be helpful. And if you did, please hit that like button and share this with your friends. You can follow me on Instagram and the handle is right here. I'll see you on the next one.